these ladies were allowing men to stay in their houses. I have a question. What happened to coming, you know, taking me from my parents' home? What happened to you're the one who's providing? How will you provide, you know, how will you be the head of this home if this is my home? That's the question. If you've got any answers, hit me up on hashtag Kwambox and Obina. And ladies, I'd love to hear from you. How are you the one who is allowing the man them to move into your home? I'm hearing such crazy stories. Juzina Skadema Mambia, um, uh, she was reporting and saying that she met this guy. The guy moved into her home. They have three kids now and she just continues to prove. It's like, what is happening? What is the problem with that? Oh, I don't see on, no problem. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, Pendana, you people need to help each other. Mm-mm. And like I said before, love is all about giving. If you know that you are about receiving, then you don't love the person. No. A woman you loves you, she lives in a bigger house than you. Yeah. Probably she has more money than you. Mm-hmm. Why not move into a house and save yours? What happened to yours? You you live it. How are you going to be the head of my home and this is my home? It's not... A home is not a, a structure. Mm-hmm. Come box. Mm-hmm. Think with me. I'm thinking. Home is an um, emotional state. Mm-hmm. Is a spiritual state. Mm-hmm. A home is not nyumba. A home is... Wh- explain here, AJ. As you figure your words out, remember hey. your morning kiss. I completely disagree with this train of thought. Ladies, I want you to call me up 0711-046-100. Would you allow a man to move into your home? Why? Yeah. Provide me that bed sitter. Provide what you can provide, but bro, ah. you cannot move into my house. Forget it. Is it how you wanted it?